into the wild part first written by kiran purandare he was uh, born 1961 after become he studied the environmental studies of jordan hill college of education in scotland he then recipient of site site puraskar pune's bhai madho bagal award and the best literature award given by the culture department of maharashtra for his uh, sakan nagjira he spent 400 days inside the nagjira near the forest areas wrote award winning book except has been taken from the sum he is the wildlife expert and bird watcher writer and honorary wildlife warden in maharashtra he also founder of the nisarga ved organization which works for nature conservation and community work around nagjira navegao the tiger reserve in bhandara and gondia district he also founded kikas bird club in order to spread bird farming which is very popular among school going children of maharashtra a kiran purandare kirandare kiran purandare is the famous bird watcher of maharashtra and he is very favorite among the students so he has given the school award for this work kiran purandare was a become from the jordan hill college of uh, scotland actually he had spent his whole life in jungle area continuously for 100 days so he was saka of nagjira he also spent some of his days in bhandara district along with along with the reserve forest project so he was very very courageous person and so he founded the kika bird club in order to spread the bird farming in the very popular among the school going children kiran purandare na 1961 sali janma sala hota ani pramukhyana maharashtra madhe asnari vyakti ki ahe ani become he scotland ma jordan hill college madhe gela साहित्य अकादमीचा अवॉर्ड त्यांना मिळालेला होता त्याचप्रमाणे यांच्या जीवनाचे सर्वात महत्वाचं वैशिष्ट्य म्हणजे पक्षी निरीक्षक म्हणून याने आपलं आयुष्य बराच काळ घालवलेलं आहे उदाहरणार्थ नागझिरा या ठिकाणी त्याचप्रमाणे नागझिरा मध्येच नवेगाव जो टायगर प्रोजेक्ट आहे वन्य पशुसंवर्धन या ठिकाणी आपले एकूण चारशे दिवस त्यांनी घालवले आणि म्हणून त्यांना साहित्य अकादमीनं अवॉर्डही दिलेला आहे अशा प्रकारचे त्यांचं कार्य आहे now next part first part of the topic into the wild as the name suggests it is a expert amazing experience of a writer where kiran purandar is solitary traveler is completely lost in jungle of um umbarsara he narrates how lost his way at the fall of the dusk and terrifying turmoil of turmoil underwent thereafter shouting for help would later remain crying in the wilderness he has also given detailed description of how found his way towards the towards the pitzari in the first part the amazing experiences has been narrated by the writer and he was a solitary reaper in the same area of umbarzara but the total surrounding was very horrifying and terrifying but he dared he dared that to wander wholly in the same area of umbarsara so he was solitary reaper but the courageous reaper he was there whenever he was crying no one was ready to help him at the critical condition so he has written the one line crying in the wilderness it gives a detailed description description how he found the way towards the pitzari this is a short summary of the first topic into the wild now i'm going to read the first part step wise but first lost in the jungle eight and half hour long day inside the hide was a fruitful as the zamba tree standing tall age of umbarzara before wrapping up a day at his natural water hole he took entry in the avifauna avifauna in my 
my field notes since I was alone. I reached a Pitzeri village where I was stationed. Camp for lunch. The high took my essential came out of the stretch out of my heart's contain. I lifted my camera bag and took the familiar trail to Pitzeri, negotiating waved leaves of teak wood and mahu trees. Trying to make the minimal sound, I was treading, treading cautiously among the wood. Walking alone in a jungle needs more alertness than walking with a companion. I was done here like a fox. Following that trail silently, watching the wide open eyes, my eyes were grasping variety of sound. Just when familiar sounds turned by cack, cack, cack. In the first paragraph, the writer has explained. He had spent eight and a half hours day inside the jungle area of Zamba where stunning tiku trees are there. But there was avifauna. Avifauna means that the birds particular region uh, living in a geographical areas means the presence of the birds writer was lived. And he lift, then he lifted his camera and going towards towards a village, name of that village is Pitzari village. In Pitzari village, all type of the peoples were living. Means there was a habitat was there. In a same jungle area, teak wood trees, mahu trees, those trees are trying to make minimal sound. In the same in the same trees, birds are making minimal sound that listened by the writer. But he was the writer was walking alone on the same road like a fox. Means he was secretly walking on the same road. But his eyes were open because in the same area, tigers were available there. Definitely tigers will attack on him. So his eyes were alert whenever he was walking in the same road. But uh, he had listened only one sound, sound that sound of cack cack sound. Like <laughs> आणि या ठिकाणी पक्ष्यांच्या साठी जे वातावरण आहे जॉग्राफिकल सराउंडिंग जे आहे ते चांगल्या प्रकारचं सराउंडिंग लेखकाने तर अनुभवलेला आहे परंतु अशा वेळेला या जंगलामध्ये सागाची झाडं महू महूची झाडं उपलब्ध आहेत त्यांचाही सुगंध पसरतोय पण लेखक जंगलामध्ये मात्र सॉलिटरी रिपर आहे एकटाच जातोय आणि एकटाच जात असताना त्याच्या जोडीला मात्र कोणी नाही पण त्यावेळेला त्याच्या मनामध्ये भीतीचं वातावरण तयार झालेलं आहे आणि त्या भीतीच्या वातावरणाचा पूर्णता विचार करून लेखक स्वतःला समजते की एखादा कोल्हा कसा जंगलामधून चोरून चोरून पावलाने जावा त्याप्रमाणे मी जंगलामधून चाललो आहे माझे डोळे उघडे आहेत कारण मला वाघाच्या हल्ल्यापासून मला वाचायचं आहे तोपर्यंत मला जंगलामध्ये ख्या ख्या नावाचा आवाज ऐकवला नेक्स्ट पॅरेग्राफ इट वॉज अ लंगूर अलार्म कॉल द लीडर ऑफ द गँग लंगूर वॉज सिटिंग ऑन द टॉल ट्री मेकिंग अलार्म कॉल आउट ऑफ अ फिअर ऑफ लाईफ Rest of the lungur breach to continue, raising the alarm call, the network of alarm call was expanding its range of the petrified lungur speed to trees near for and secured their places on tree top. All is unappeal was created by one animal presence of leopard, mean animal make alarm call when, when they see the predator, tiger of leopard nearby, the lungur is most reliable. When it comes finding clues about the presence of apex predator in jungle, the mighty exclusive leopard of Umbar, Umbar Zara was out of the lair, out of the lair and was on the prowl. Steadily moving figure of spotted gold, gold a black cloak was spied that is Langur. Even the small one from the legion of Langur were giving alarm call cack cack. In the second paragraph, the writer has explained they Mob of the langur, langur means monkeys. The mob of langur was making kak kak sound in the jungle area. Why they are making kak kak sound? They are making kak kak sound because they had seen leopard. They had seen leopard in the same area. And leopard is very dangerous wild animal. That animal will go into attack, attack the langur. So that langur had, that langur had informed all remaining, uh, remaining groups of the langur. Here comes the tiger, here comes the leopard. So you should be careful about the arrival of the tiger and be safe from his attack. So they are once again created the sound, kek, kek, kek. 
नाही यामध्ये काय सांगले की लेखक सांगतोय की या जंगलामध्ये ख्याख्या करावाचा आवाज ऐकतो तो ख्याख्या आवाज माकडांचा होता माकडांच्या वेळेला एखाद्या विचित्र प्राण्याला पाहतात किंवा वाघाला पाहतात ते ख्याख्या कसा आवाज करतात त्या आवाजून त्यांना सांगायचं की या जंगलामध्ये एक मोठ्या प्रकारचा चित्त आलेला आहे तुम्ही सावधान राहा तुमच्या जीवाला कोणता तरी धोका आहे हा धोका एका एका असणाऱ्या माकडाच्या आवाजून होत नाही तर अनेकांच्या होतो ज्यावेळे एकानं आवाज काढला जातो इतरांना तो मेसेज पोचत असतोय संदेश देतो त्याप्रमाणे सर्व माकडांना तो संदेश पोचतो आणि त्यामुळे त्या लक्षात येतं की या जंगलामध्ये कुठेतरी वाघ चित्त आलेला आहे आणि त्याच्यापासून उमरझरामध्ये चित्त आलेला आहे त्याचा आपल्या जीवनाला खूप धोका आहे सर्व लंगर एकत्रित येतात आणि अशा प्रकारे परत येत त्यांच्या आवाजाची रंगत वाढते ख्याक 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 सेकंड पॅरेग्राफ फिनिश थर्ड पॅरेग्राफ आय स्टे पुट अँड गॅ गेज अर द लिडल लंगोर टार्गेट इन साईड अँड स्कॅन द एरिया व्हिज्युअली टुक सम स्टेप्स स्टॉप अगेन अ फ्रेश अ फ्रेश कॅट वॉज लाईंग बिफोर मी ऑन द ट्रेल द ब्लश पर्पल फ्लाईज हवरिंग हवरिंग इट वॉज आय शुअर दॅट लेपड ऑफ समवेअर नियर the distant alarm call for hand antelope was adding to the chaos i barely walked around 15 meters swap i had apparently entered the sanctum sanctorum of miracle called leopard but the big cat was not visible it is an eclosive animal surrounding were reminding me that i was all alone time again as i moved forward on the trail of pitesari Hearing the alarm call still heard in the background, I could tell instinctively that leopard had moved away. In the third paragraph, the lung, the lung, the langur, the langur had created the sound because they had they had seen the arrival of the leopard, arrival of the tiger in the same area. But that was the signal. That was the signal of them. So the le le antelope. antelope means a deer is also making the sound in the same area because that antelope is totally prey of the tiger so that antelope is made the creative sound or frightening sound after the arrival of the tiger in the same area after some time writer turned back and he saw at that time he he had seen that the tiger had gone away from this place next paragraph Meanwhile, I saw a man standing at a distance with a stick in his hand. As I approached, and he appeared as spooked due to alarm caused the leopard. We greeted each other. He was a Raju, Raju, Raju K from Pitzeri. He had come to collect the logs, but retreated due to the leopard's movement. Raju was amazed at my regular solitary visit to Umbarzara, the heaven for tiger. Leopard and a sloth deer stopped under the kusum tree. to take break we both felt the bit relaxed now we were four eyes four hands with a stick then both resume our walking tour there was one tiny track of broke out of the main trail how will take this road you go you go straight said raju and in turn i kept walking straight until i climbed a famir hill rock i crossed the cement pillar of stone stairs by the forest department corporation to make the boundary of the forest compartment took another trail took another trail after climbing down walked up across the beautiful mohua tree loaded with a reddish brown leaves and the ground under the tree was cleaned very well thought instantly flashed in the my mind i would lost my way next moment i found another dusky trail as still i took the trail which took me for the narrow gorge on a open field The area was surrounded by the hillocks of the delicious uh, deciduous tropical forest. I turned back to spot the sun. Now the geographical waste was set. The dusky trail had vanished. Good heavens! I was lost, completely lost in the jungle. Two very dreadful times. The sun was melting down like a like a floating runner. The writer was. <laughs> The writer was approached by the one of the jungle jungle friend and his name was Raju Raju Tape. He had come in the forest not to collect the logs. But he suddenly stopped on the particular spot because he came to know that here is the arrival of the tiger. If the tiger will come in front of us, if the tiger will come in front of us definitely he will attack us. So he had controlled himself but after some time he met 
he met his friend means to the writer that is kiran purandare and both of them came together and he told him that you are also my best friend so we are we have four hands four four legs and four eyes that is information of the pair given in the same paragraph but he told to the writer you have to change your route definitely you will reach on your destination so the writer had changed his route and turned towards the forest development corporation corporation area and he walked across the beautiful mahua tree the mahua mahua tree had also reddish reddish and brown leaves that that area was very clean area and writer felt very happy and he said good heaven that area is very beautiful and very clean area but he was lost he was lost in the same area but it was that jungle area but the sun was melting down like a fleeting fleeting runner lekak manto ki mala cha jangla madhe ek maza mitra bhetla tyacha nav tyacha nav ta te manje raju raju kape ki jo pitzari cha hota to eka tikane thamlelo ta jangla madhe lakado gola karun tela jaycho hota pan achalak pane tela vagacha agmana chi chahur lagli ani to tya tikane thamto ani kai na kalanta to mala bhetto tevha ami doge ek mekanje mitra bhanlo mitra bhanlanta tyani मला मी त्याला सांगितलं की मी जंगलामध्ये एकूण चारशे दिवस घालवले मला या ठिकाणी दुसऱ्या ठिकाणी जायचं तर त्याने सांगितलं पुढे रस्ता आहे तिथे तुम्ही एक कॉर्नर आहे एक वळण आहे तिथून तुम्ही जा त्यानंतर मी गेलो गेल्यानंतर जंगलामध्ये गेलो जंगलामध्ये असणारी जे काही जंगलाची शेमारी शाखली आहे तिथपर्यंत गेलो त्यावेळेला मला तिथं मोहाचं झाड दिसलं आणि लाल रंगाची मोहाची फुलं त्या झाडाला आलेली होती आणि तो परिसर खूप सुंदर होता आणि नर्सरीष्ट खूप चांगला असल्यामुळं मला बरं वाटलं मला खूप आनंद झाला परंतु मात्र या जंगलामध्ये मी हरवलेलो होतो जरी हरवलो असलो तरी मला वाटलं आता सूर्य मात्र हळाळ होता माध्यानीला झुकला होता नेक्स्ट पॅरेग्राफ सो कड इन माय ओन स्वेट आय फेल लाईक ए शाउटिंग टू माय हार्ट कंटेन बट देर इज नो अदर सोल टू लिसन माय साऊंड इन दिस वर्ल्डनेस आय हॅव टू बॅग विथ शवणम बॅग हॅव्हिंग द कॅमेरा अदर वॉज अ स्मॉल कलरफुल हँडमेड बॅग यूज इन द विलेज carry tip in the tip of steer had some of the stuff but i didn't feel like having it the blossoming box box wood trees whoop whoop sound of conkel bird the song of robin bird and appear aligned to me the writer the writer's body was gateway his body was gateway and he was, he was shouting but no one was ready to listen his shouting but he was alone walking in the jungle area so he said support himself as a alone person alone person in the same area but in his shabnam there was a camera he had a carried camera along with him to take the photos of the jungle area the villagers carried tip in he also carried tip in along along with him but he had not had his tip in that tip in was remain as it is but blooming boxwood trees was there who who sound council bird and the rabbit bird sound was listened by the writer next it was more than an hour i was still there searching for a suitable tree climb to get secured turn back to the uh, trail you left my mind was telling me but there were no sign of the trail i had no other way to climb the hillock before me there were more hillocks and some more around the one i was standing near my feet where the dried up dropping of the swag beer the slot bear of the umber zara must be out of open sniffing for food i continued myself thinking of overing overting all the sorts of eventuality i made a move i ran down to hill up that i had to climb up to frantic speed the west was my right hand side now the evening breeze flew flew through my wet curled hair my stomach was aching i kept walking in hopes the writer was the writer was searching suitable place in order to in order to take rest so he had decided to climb on that tree top and he seated there but it was not the safety place for him at that time he had he had seen the sloth bear in umbazra sniffing here and there means the bear was sniffing because he wanted food but he had not a food so the writer uh, the writer was watching towards that uh, sloth bear but suddenly the pains were coming pains were coming in the stomach of the writer and he decided to keep rest for a while 
लेखक म्हणतो की मी जंगलामध्ये आल्यानंतर मला एका ठिकाणी विश्रांती घ्यावी एका ठिकाणी विश्रांती घ्यावी असं वाटलं आणि म्हणून मी काय केलं की या विश्रांती घेत असताना विश्रांती घेत असताना मी ठरलं की झाडाच्या झाडाच्या वरती विश्रांती घ्यावी परंतु विश्रांती घेताना मला एक मला त्या ठिकाणी एक असं दिसलं की जे अन्न शोधत आहे ते उपवास शोधतं माझ्याप्रमाणे फायनली माझ्या लक्षात आलं की माझ्या पोठा माझ्या पोठामध्ये दुःख लागलेलं आहे मी विश्रांती घेण्याचं ठरवलं आफ्टर फिफ्टीन स्टेप्स फाउंड आय ब्राईट रेड सॉइल ट्रेल फाउंड माय सिल्वर लर्निंग ऑफ द ट्रेल देर ऑज अ मार्क्स ऑफ द बायसिकल ऑफ दिस ट्रेल दॅट वॉज अ बिग कन्सोलेशन फॉर मी देर मस्ट बी विलेज नियर बाय आय शोड माय सेट मोर क्वेश्चन रिअर्ड हाऊ फॉर इज द विलेज अँड वेअर आय विच डायरेक्शन आय क्लाइम अप मोर हिलॉक्स अँड ट्राय टू लोकेट सायन ऑफ ह्युमे ह्युमन सिव्हिलायझेशन माय लेग्स वेअर ट्रॅव्हलिंग आय रीच अ टॉप ऑफ द हिल जम्प विथ अ जॉय आय हर्ड द साऊंड ऑफ द पीपल talking about the loud speaker in jippy i can i ran down i ran down on the hill towards the sound of the full vigor i stumbled down fell saw the dropping of the blue bulbs nearby staggering stood and decided to direction on move the signs of civilization were visible the tiny sleepy village of pit zari was visible through the green wood the lantern of rajiram rajiram balwi's farm loud speaker installed Kesho's Balwi's marriage and all were in clear sight turned left to spot of village lake and familiar hill of Sihu Daki the dog barked a welcome me to village the first thing i did was to take both the shaking of the limb had less had lessened the beat a stomach ache started again at the feel of slab into the cot lying away at the star strange sky i spoke myself there still exist a jungle where we can get lost it's the our good luck taken from saka najira by kiran purande here ends first part translate shevti lekhakana shevti lekhakana tharalo ki jangalamadhe phirat astana eka jhadavati vishranti geto tyavelela lekhakana aswala chi footprints aswala chi jani jali pan te aswal pramukhyana bhiti na thamblele hota pan shevti mala मला एका विलेजकडे जायची वेळ आली आणि त्या विलेजकडे मी जात असताना मला असं वाटलं की त्या ठिकाणी विश्रांती मिळेल धूर येत होता लाऊडस्पीकर लागलेला होता तर त्या राजाराम बलवीचा जो मंडप मला त्या ठिकाणी दिसला त्या मंडप लग्नासाठी मांडलेला होता मग मला खरं खरोखर स्वरूप कळालं आणि मी त्या दिशेनं शोध घेत घेतो मला गावाचा शोध मिळू लागला परंतु माझ्या पोटामध्ये असणाऱ्या ज्या वेदना आहेत त्या वाढतच गेल्या आणि शेवटी मी एका ठिकाणी विश्रांती घ्यायचं ठरवलं आणि अशा प्रकारे हा पहिला पाठ सका नागशिरा या असणाऱ्या या असणाऱ्या छोट्याशा वेच्यामधून घेण्यात आलेला आहे इथे पहिला भाग संपतो थँक्यू